YouTube, I am so excited right now. I did this ride back in Japan, but Harry was speaking Japanese and I couldn't understand anything. Yaho, YouTube, I am super Genki. And in today's video, I'm gonna give you some tips on how to step outside of your comfort zone. Oh, YouTube, before we even start the video, if you're gonna go to a theme park, for the love of everything that is good in the world, don't be cheap. Please, please, please get the Express Pass. Please. <laughs> ah. If you don't get the Express Pass, you're gonna end up only going on one to two rides. Today, we are at Universal Studios, Island of Adventure. As we talked about in the last video, opportunities have lifelines. And if you don't ask to extend the lifeline, you might miss the opportunity when it comes. But as opposed to asking, how many opportunities go by just because we don't say yes? If you're watching this video, you're probably thinking to yourself, Wow! Island of Adventure! That's so cool! I want to go! But, you too. I'm actually on a family trip right now. And if I hadn't been invited to go to Universal Studios, I wouldn't have wanted to go to Universal Studios. You want to check out the dinosaur? When I think about confidence, I like to think about it in the ratio of yes to no. How many times are you saying yes to an opportunity versus how many times are you saying no to an opportunity? If you're saying yes a lot more than you're saying no, you might want to slow it down a little bit. If you're saying no a lot more than you're saying yes, you might want to pick up the pace. Because not all opportunities are going to be good opportunities. But if you don't take a lot of them, you'll never figure out which ones are good and which ones are bad. You'll never be able to tell the difference. That's why you want to take them as frequently as possible. So YouTube, my challenge to you today is the next time you are offered an opportunity to do something, to go somewhere, to learn something, take that opportunity. Of course, first, you want to use your head. You want to make sure that it's something that you want to do, something you like to do, somewhere you want to go. But don't undervalue the prospect of getting that opportunity. Because the worst thing that can happen is that you get some perspective on what opportunities you want to take. And the best thing that can happen is, who knows, but you get to figure it out. And that's what's really, really cool. Anyway, you two, that's the video for today. If this video helped you out, don't forget to smash that like button, leave a comment, subscribe to the channel, and share it with your friends. We need to get the good word of positive thinking out there to as many people as possible. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.